talk to the universe like this and watch what happens in your life. Talk to the universe like this and watch the magic that is going to unfold in your life. This is Jake Ducey with jakeducey.com and here's how you talk to the universe so that magic starts happening in your life. Let's dive right into this video. So there's a story of this woman and it goes something like this. She was really wanted to, to be in a relationship. She wanted to attract love and her soulmate and it wasn't working the way she wanted. So she was frustrated and she just got a new job and she was on the way to her, to her job and she was, she was late and her tire popped and she was really getting worried. So she's over on the side of the road, her tire pop, she doesn't have her phone on her, she just started this new job, and to top it all off, she's frustrated because she's been trying to attract a relationship. And she's sitting there, and she hears a, a voice. Excuse me, ma'am, can I help you? She looks up, and it's this beautifully handsome man. And she turns to him, she says, matter of fact, you can help me. And turns out the guy fixes her tire and they end up going on a date together and they fall in love and they end up starting their own business together and they end up being happy as can be financially successful. They're in love. They're happy. And it came out of absolutely nowhere. Guess what? My friend, God's timing is perfect. The universe's timing is perfect. Spirit always manifests itself perfectly. Comment down below, God's timing is perfect. If you don't like the word God, use the word universe. The universe's timing is perfect. Comment that right there down below. And if you want another phrase, use this phrase. Spirit always manifests itself perfectly. Spirit always manifests itself perfectly. Comment that right there down below. What I'm trying to tell you is that your prayers have already been answered. Your prayers have already been answered. What you've been praying for, what you've been working towards, what you've wanted is already answered. Just because it hasn't happened yet doesn't mean anything's wrong, right? This woman was getting frustrated and then out of nowhere, this happens. There is a set time for your destiny. There is a set time for the things that you desire. And it might be easier sometimes to, you know, Wish you already knew the answer to everything. This is when the money is going to come. This is when the job is going to come. The soulmate's going to come. But if you knew all that, then there would be no reason for faith. And the whole course of things, the whole purpose of things is to teach us faith and to teach us to communicate with and talk to the universe. And so comment down below that God's timing is perfect. The universe's timing is perfect. So here's what you say to the universe. You say, universe, I trust your timing. All is well. God, I trust your timing. All is well. Comment that down below. And this is what you say. So right now, while you're, while you're listening to me, practice saying this. If you can say it out loud, say it out loud. If you cannot, then just say it within your own mind. Universe, your timing is perfect. All is well. God, your timing is perfect. All is well. That's how you talk to the universe because there's a divine intelligence that governs our life. And until you're in a place where you have faith, oftentimes what you want will continue to elude you because you have to learn certain lessons before you get things that you want because you're a spiritual being in a physical body. You're a soul in a physical body. And you incarnated here in order to learn certain spiritual lessons, one of which is faith. And so, Sometimes, until you can learn faith and practice faith and show up in faith, what you want will continue to elude you, almost like, you know, a, a, a dog that's the carrots out in front of it and it's constantly chasing after the carrot. It will continue to elude you like that until you can rest assured and say confidently, and it begins sometimes without confidence, but it begins by saying so, by speaking it into existence. And so what I'm inviting you to do is start speaking your faith in God, speaking your faith in the universe into existence. And by God, I, I'm talking about the divine source of all things. I'm talking about every single thing is energy. Your wall is energy. This chair is energy. Your computer is energy. 
And science tells us that 95% of an atom is empty space. And what I'm talking about is that divine intelligence, that divine energy, that spirit energy that permeates, penetrates, and fills every single cell of your body. It permeates, penetrates, and fills every single molecule of, of, of the walls in the room you're in, of your computer, it's in everything. And it's a consciousness that is always aware of your consciousness and, and how your consciousness is tuned. And what I'm inviting you to do is tune your consciousness into faith right now. Tune your mind into faith right now by affirming, Universe, your timing is always perfect. All is well. Universe, your timing is perfect all is well. And what this is doing is moving you out of a lack energy and moving you out of a fear-based energy of anticipation, uh, of fear of what if it doesn't happen? Is it going to happen? Am I good enough? Am I smart enough? Is something wrong with me? Does the universe not love me? Am I being punished for past karma? What's going on? Maybe it's not meant to be. No, it's none of that. It's that until you can learn to rest assured in faith, what you want can't show up. Because it says, it says, it says in, in the Bible that, that to those that have more will be given and to those that do not have, even that which they have will be taken away from them. That second part is talking about the level of consciousness you're operating at. It's really talking about the law of attraction. So it says to those that do not have, even that which they have will be taken away. If you don't have faith, you're in an energy of it's not going to happen. It might not happen. And what that is really doing is sending a subconscious message that what you want isn't going to occur and it might not occur, which is a lack of faith. So your subconscious accepts reality as you tell it. And when you're telling it that the subconscious says, oh, okay, the money isn't on the way. Oh, okay. The love isn't on the way. Oh, okay. The job isn't on the way. Okay you're not going to get out of debt soon. Okay, you're not going to transform your health soon. Okay, that that big break, that big opportunity, your set time for your divine miracle and the perfect uh, unfoldment of what it is that you're desiring will not show up yet. Because you've told it that it's not by saying, is this going to happen? I don't know. Da, da, da. You have to replace those thoughts and you have to change your consciousness and get a direct pipeline with solid communication to the universe. So affirm. The universe's timing is always perfect. Spirit never manifests itself other than perfectly. You have to get your consciousness on the wavelength of faith. And when you're on the wavelength of faith, that's when the things happen. That's when great things start to occur. That's when the miracles unfold because you're in the possibility rather than the limitation. Everything is really two things. The possibility or the presence of what you want, or the absence of what you want. And if your mind is fixated on the absence of what you want, you're not in faith. Not only are you not in faith, but you're in limitation. You're either in a have consciousness or a have not consciousness. A have not consciousness is I hope, I wish, I don't know if it's gonna happen, is this meant to be, am I not good enough, is there something wrong with me, is this just blah, 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 blah. And what you're really saying is, the money's not here. The love's not here. I'm not good enough. I have this problem that's wrong with me and that's why it's not gonna happen. I'm being punished for my karma. I didn't go to the right school. And so your subconscious says, okay, you're limited in this way because the subconscious doesn't have logic. It just accepts whatever energy or method or message you send to it. Take a step back. Realize that every time you've needed something, the universe has shown up. Take a step back and realize that we live in a perfect universe. Look at this. The exact location that the earth needed to be from the sun for there to be life on earth, it happened. If we were a little bit closer, we'd be a ball of fire. If we were a little bit further, we'd be like Pluto and, and th this thing would be a frozen tundra and nobody would be able to live here. Not to mention the fact we're the perfect distance that allows oxygen to be here. All of these things like Really? Like, that is divine perfection. Everything works out perfectly. The fact that you just came out of, out of a, out of, out of your mother's womb and your heart beat on its own, you grew, your fingernails grow, your hair grows. This is divine intelligence. Now, you can resist this and you can doubt yourself and you can react to the world, or you, I invite you to take a step back and recognize this divine perfection is always here for you. 
It's here to, 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 to help you. It's here to support you. But you must affirm that the universe timing is perfect and always works out for you. Now, if you have a problem with that, download my free success hypnosis right there down below, jakeshypnosis.com, because a lot of those thought patterns are just conditioning. They're subconscious conditioning locked in the subconscious mind. And the subconscious mind is 65,000 thoughts in a day, and 95% of them are habitual. So right there down below, it's free. It's jakeshypnosis.com, and it'll start to erase those negative thought patterns and replace them with thoughts of success, abundance, and prosperity to make the waiting process for what you want much easier. It's jakeshypnosis.com right there down below. And what I'm inviting you to do is affirm three or four times in your head right now, spirit always manifests itself perfectly. The universe has my back. Spirit always manifests itself perfectly. The universe always has my back. Comment that down below. Spirit always manifests itself perfectly. The universe has my back. Spirit always manifests itself perfectly. The universe has my back. Spirit always manifests itself perfectly in your life. The universe truly has your back. There's no need to doubt yourself. Am I good enough? Am I smart enough? Do I, is this problem with me? Is this thing wrong with me? Is this why I'm not going to get it? Is it, is it, is it, is there not enough, uh, is there not enough money? Is my true love not out there? It's all there. It's all there for you. You're here to be rewarded in life. You're here to experience abundance. You're worthy of everything that you desire, but it won't show up until you're in faith. So right now, affirm great things are on the way. Prosperity shows up in my life. Love is here in my life. Happiness is here in my life. All good things come to me. I am a magnet for good things. You are a magnet for good things. Great things show up and unfold in your life. See, once you start to say those and affirm those things and start to uh, like rest assured in those things, the magic starts to happen. And that's why I talk about my success hypnosis because it'll do it for you. It'll make the process easier. It's jakeshypnosis.com and it's free right there down below. So here's what. This little space rock called planet Earth is a perfect distance from the sun. Too far, one direction, and we got a frozen tundra. Too close the other way, and we just got a gas fireball thing. And we wouldn't be here. How do you explain that? Coincidence. No. There's a divine intelligence orchestrating your life. And it's here to support you. But you got to open up to it. And the way that you're going to open up to it is to start to affirm right now. Universe, your timing is perfect. All is well. God, your timing is perfect. All is well. Spirit, your timing is perfect. All is well. Spirit, you always manifest yourself perfectly in my life with abundance, with joy, with success, with freedom, with opportunity. I can feel it coming and I have absolute faith. I can feel it coming. I have absolute faith. I know it's on the way. I have absolute faith. You have to speak your faith into existence. You have to say so. You have to speak your faith into existence. Even at first, if you don't have faith, the way that you acquire it is the same way you acquire stanima while you're running. You have to start running. You have to start practicing running to build the stanima. You have to start practicing push-ups in order to be able to do more push-ups. You have to practice speaking your faith into existence before it becomes more natural for you to rely on the universe, before it becomes more natural for you to rely on the divine intelligence of abundance, of love, of happiness that wants to support you, but it's a world of free will and you're here to learn certain spiritual lessons. And so if you're, if, if, if you're constantly doubting yourself, the universe has to be hands off and allow you to ultimately express your free will and step into faith and step into abundance and step into joy and step into certainty and step into confidence. There is a set time for you to meet your soulmate. There is a set time for you to land the perfect job. There is a set time for you to be out of debt and start making the money you desire. There is a set time for you to move into your dream home. There is a set time for everything that you want. And you may not see it, and you may not believe it yet, but it's here, and it's coming, and it's on the way, but you gotta get your consciousness in possibilities rather than limitations. You gotta get your consciousness focused on your inner world rather than any limitations or problems you see in your outer world. I am inviting you to take a deep breath in, 
and let out your stress and let out your worry and let out your fear and let out your doubt. You are rest assured, surrounded in possibilities, supported by the same divine intelligence that has us on a little speck of dust flying through infinite space. You are supported by the same intelligence that has us circulating around the sun at the perfect distance. If it can do that, by all means, it can get you out of debt. By all means, it can restore your health, vitality, confidence. By all means, it can bring you the money that you desire. But you have to speak it into existence. You have to affirm your faith. You have to affirm your abundance and your right and your worthiness of all it is that you desire. And it is coming and it is and it is on the way. And you are a divine being and you have to start to speak it into existence while you're watching it. Use my videos as training to start practicing it, to start saying it to yourself while you're watching it. Whenever my videos speak to you, please, 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 when they end, watch them again. When I, I don't, I don't go for reading as many books as possible. I reread the same books over and over. I don't go for watching 75 different YouTube channels. I find videos that I like and I re-watch them through over and over and over again. Now the reason I do that is so I really get the essence of it and I allow it to sink into my habitual mind, into my subconscious mind. Imagine if you listened to this 10 times. Imagine if you allowed this to play like that 10 times. Imagine if every day as you're watching a new video of mine, imagine you keep coming back to the videos that speak to you as well and you allow the idea to sink in. Just imagine if you heard this, this message every day. By the 15th day, by the fourth day, by tomorrow, by next week, by the 10th time you've heard it, by the fourth time you heard it, you're gonna be walking around on your sidewalk out, out on your morning walk in your neighborhood, you're gonna be on the way to work, you're gonna be driving to the grocery store, and you're gonna be like, universe, thank you for your abundance. I know that it always manifests itself perfectly. Great things are on the way. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Your whole consciousness will shift. Your whole life will transform. So, what I'm inviting you to do is know that you are blessed. See, use this as a thought training ground. I am blessed. The universe has my back. How could it not have your back? It built your back. It built all your vertebras. It, it, it grew. There's a divine intelligence that grew uh, your, your brain cells that beats your heart. You don't have to remind your heart to beat. It, it, it allowed you to grow within your mother's womb. It, it allowed for the perfect amount of oxygen and carbon for us to have life here on planet Earth. It, it allows the sun to rise at just the perfect distance where it doesn't melt planet Earth, but it allows for trees to grow and thus produce oxygen. And we just happen to have lungs that are able to breathe in the oxygen and release the carbon. It's like, oh, how does this happen? This is divine intelligence here. It grows our fingernails. Like it does all of these things. And it's right here to support you. If it could do those things, don't you think that it could attract money into your life this week out of nowhere? Don't you think that your soulmate is out there? Don't you think that you can restore your health and that through the grace of the universe, your your confidence and your faith and your excitement and vitality for life will be restored and renewed and your mind will be transformed and you'll be uplifted and you'll have the happiest rest of your life because you finally tapped into this level of consciousness. Don't you think that that's possible if all those other things can happen? The universe has your back. All is well. Dude, I'm telling you, just me to you, this life is beautiful and you are a beautiful person. You are a powerful person. You are a capable person. You have within you access to this universal intelligence, to the mind of God, to the divine mind. And this divine mind did all those things with the solar system. Don't you think it can help you solve all your problems? Don't you think you can come up with the best ideas ever? Technically, you wouldn't even come up with them. They'll come through you. They will come to you. But you have to start affirming this thing. You have to start saying, I am a genius and I apply my wisdom. Comment that down below. I am a genius and I apply my wisdom. You have to start taking deep breaths and letting out your anxiety and your fear. And every time you catch yourself doubting, every time you catch yourself getting getting anxious, every time you, you catch yourself doubting yourself and critiquing yourself, you take a step back and you say, I'm a divine being. 
God's potential flows within me. The universe's timing is perfect and I know great things are on the way. I am supported. I am uplifted. I know that the winds of abundance are at my back. I'm a beautiful person. I'm a worthy person. My past is irrelevant now. Here I am in this moment. I have a smile on my face. I'm showing up to life and I know that great things are on the way. I know I'm attracting the perfect people. I know I'm attracting the perfect situations. I know that the universe has a divine plan and there is a set time for me to bring in the most amazing things into my life. Comment down below, I am a divine being worthy of everything that I desire. See, this is this type of stuff that makes the universe smile down on you. Because it's like, man, you're finally starting to get it, that you're a divine being. You're finally starting to get it, that there is a divine intelligence that will help you, that is supporting you, that is full of abundance, that you have a right to be rich, you have a right to be happy, you have a right to be healthy, you have a right to be excited about life, and, and, great things are on the way. Just look around. There's great things everywhere. Just look around. There's fantastic things unfolding in your life. You may have not noticed yet, but take a deep breath and look around. Get your mind on the possibilities. However small the possibilities are, get your mind focused on them and then they'll start expanding. Where attention goes, energy flows. And not just your energy, but the universe's energy. When your attention is on the is on God's abundance, is on the universe's prosperity, is on the great opportunities and abundance and success and happiness and joy and love, the universe, the higher intelligence says, oh, look, she's noticing. Oh, look, he's noticing. Let me bring more into your life. Because the consciousness determines everything. To those that have, more will be given. That's why I'm spending all of my energy, as much energy as I possibly can, focus on the great things about money, the great things about happiness, the beautiful love, the amazing people in this world. That's why I don't spend time looking around and finding things that are wrong because I can't afford it. My life is too short. Your life is too short. The average life expectancy is 72 and a half years. That is too short of a time for you and I to spend another moment worrying, another moment doubting ourselves, another moment judging other people, another moment saying, ah, am I good enough? Am I smart enough? You wouldn't be here if you weren't good enough. You wouldn't be here if you weren't smart enough. You wouldn't be here if you weren't worthy and deserving. You wouldn't be here if you couldn't tap into the potential of God and God couldn't open doors for you. The universe couldn't open doors for you spirit couldn't open doors for you where it looked like there was only walls. So you may be lying in your, in your room of life and you may be looking around and it looks like there's no doors. But you're in an infinite mansion. There are great things on the way and you must start affirming it. God, your timing is perfect. All is well. Universe, your timing is perfect. All is well. Spirit always manifests itself perfectly. I know great things are on the way. I'm breathing in happiness. I'm releasing fear. I'm breathing in happiness. I'm releasing fear. I'm breathing in happiness. I'm releasing fear. Say that to yourself right now as you're breathing in and out. I'm breathing in happiness. I'm releasing fear. So thank you for watching this video. This is Jake Ducey with jakeducey.com. Hit the subscribe button, the bell notification right over there. Bell notification is what notifies you for new videos. So even if you already subscribed, double check you've actually hit the bell notification right over there. You are a divine being worthy of everything that you desire. Comment down below, God's timing is perfect. The universe has my back. God's timing is perfect. The universe has my back. God's timing is perfect. The universe has your back back. If you haven't yet, make sure that you download and start to demo and use my software, The Second Mind. It's a software using neuroscience designed to rewire your brain so your brain will become a magnet so the things that you want show up quicker, faster, and easier, harnessing the power of the universe. It's thesecondmind.com and you can demo it for free. Have a beautiful day. Hit the like button on this video if you enjoy it. Watch this video back through as many times as you can. Share it with your friends. Share it on social media. Have a beautiful day. Thank you for watching. Great things are on the way.